Yo, what's good, YouTube? What's good? What's hood? How y'all doing? How y'all feeling, man? Listen, today I got a special video topic, man. Today I'm finna be talking about Miss Larsa Pippen and Marcus Jordan. So for y'all who don't know, Marcus Jordan is the son of NBA legend, Hall of Fame, arguably the greatest player of all time, Michael Jordan, all right? That's his son, right? Marcus Jordan. So he played college ball, but he's nowhere near the player that... uh Michael Jordan was, you know what I'm saying? Like, he he's not nice at all. He played college ball. He about 6'3", but never really did too much with it, you know what I mean? So, I think now he's like an entrepreneur, making money, doing other shit. But basketball, not it, bro. Not it. So, this is a prime example, right, <clears throat> of a dude who was born on third base, born with money, born into it, but he never really had to get it out the mud. He never really uh, had to work for it, right? So he doesn't really have the skill set of being a real man, honestly, bro. He, he doesn't have it. He just he was he was one of those dudes that was born into it. And anytime, bro, you like your father's like Michael Jordan status, it's a lot to live up to. A lot of times they're a disappointment and they don't live up to their father's name. You know what I mean? Nowhere close. But it's like. I mean, you ain't gotta be—you ain't gotta be a basketball player, but the decisions you make needs to be commensurate with who your father was. You know what I'm saying? Your father had a lot of status, and right now you fucking up his status by doing what you're doing right now. So, for y'all who don't know, Marcus Jordan, Michael Jordan's son, wants to get married to Larsa Pippen. Larsa Pippen is Scottie Pippen's ex-wife. They've been together for over like 20 years, since like the, the 90s, my nigga. Crazy. They've been together for a, a mad long time, right? And this nigga wants to cuff her, right? Old ass Larsa Pippen. I don't know how, I think she's in her 40s or 50s. I, I think she's in her 40s. I don't know. But that's an L. It's an L all, all the way. One, because she's older. She's a thotty. I mean, literally, bro, she's known for being Pippin's ex-wife. It's like, what are you doing? Like, why are you? And she looks crazy. She, You can tell she got a bunch of work done. She looks crazy, bro. But I'm telling you, I, I, it goes to show you, man, a lot of these dudes, they just don't know. They are just so blue pill. They're so beta. They're just so unaware. And they just make dumbass decisions like this, trying to cuff Larsa Pippin. Like, what are you doing with your life, my brother? What are you doing? And the thing is, she's another one with a shady past. She been with, bro, not only has she been with Pippin, but it was alleged that she cheated with Future. She done smashed Future. She was saying Tristan Thompson. She go from one ball to the next. I'm like, yo, you cuff this? What are you doing? But the thing is, bro, when you have status, the the female is, can mess it up. You know what I'm saying? Females can 100% mess up your status and what you got going on in your reputation. So now, and then Michael Jordan, he 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 almost damn near like disowned him. He said, I, I, I don't I don't support the marriage. That shit bullshit. My son should not be married to this thought. And I agree. You need you need to listen to your father, dumbass nigga. You need to listen to your father and stop being such a de de degenerate little nigga. Okay? Because what are you doing trying to marry old ass, thotty ass Larsa Pippen? What are you doing? Like Come on, man. And the thing is, bro, she's another one of them superficial, thotty type women who goes from one athlete or rapper to the next. And then it's like a woman who who will cheat, and a woman who does that, who goes from one one uh one baller to the next, and who cheats on them. Like, come on, man. That's not white for material, man. That's not. What are you doing? You need to see. You need to know this. You okay? You need to understand this, but. Marcus Jordan thinks, oh no, this is a prize. This is a prized woman. This one, I, I, I would be lucky to be with her. Crazy. Why, why, why is she a prize? She's been ran through. She's old. She's, I mean, she's literally, she, bro, she got to be in her forties, bro. And I'm not trying to just talk shit, but I'm saying maybe as a, as a person, she's a nice person. Maybe she, you know what I mean? She could be a nice person, but when it comes to a relationship, she does not have any value anymore, bro. This ain't the nineties. She's older. She's been ran through. Her her history is fucked up. She looks kind of fucked up because all that all that work she's got done. It's like dudes don't know how to pick them no more, man. Dudes just pick. I'm I'm honestly convinced 
that high status dudes and high value dudes just pick. I, I think they just pick the biggest name females and they're like, yes, that's who I want to be with. That's like, bro, do you not take into consideration all the other guys she's been with, all the rumors and 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 fucked up history that's associated with her name? It's like they just it goes in one ear out the neck and out the other. They just forget it. It's like, what do you like, bro? Do you not realize what you're doing? Like, bro, these this new generation of niggas. and it's he's in his thirties though, so I can't even say new generation of niggas because he's in his thirties. So what does that make him a uh, gen? Not Gen Z. What is he a millennial? I don't know, but it's like I can't even put that on the new niggas because he's thirty two. Dumbass nigga. I'm like, what are you doing, bro? You. You got, I mean, you're not a, you're not no basketball player like your father, but I mean, bro, you're 6'3", you probably was born in the money. Come on, man. And you decide to go for Scotty Pippen's ex-wife. Like, who does that? Who who goes after somebody's ex-wife of 20 years? Like, yeah, that's who I want to marry. What the fuck? What are you doing? I don't even think she can have kids, bro. I'm not even trying to be fucked up, but I don't even think she can have kids. She's so damn old. Like what, what? I don't. I, I honestly don't know what's going on, man. I don't. I I really don't, man. But listen, all you young boys know what to look for in women and know how to pick them. Know how to pick talent, bro. My father always told me, you gotta know how to pick talent. The girl who got the biggest ass, the girl who's out there, who's seen as the sexiest, is not the one you want to cuff. You get what I'm saying? The one you want to cuff should be. Laid back, chill, submissive, feminine, acts like a woman, doesn't have crazy history surrounding her name, doesn't have a bunch of dudes that she smashed out in the open. Like, that should be, bro, your woman's sexual history should be slim to none. But if anything, it should be, what's the word? It should be covered. It should be, it should be concealed. It shouldn't be out in the limelight. If you're, if it's a no, if it's known who your girl's smashing, the different dudes that she's been dealing with. It's an L. It, it makes you look like a fool. It's what you guys don't understand. It makes you look dumb. Damn, you cuff her? You dumb as shit. Like, bro. when will y'all realize this shit, man? Like, bro, your woman, her sexual history should be, that shouldn't even be out in the open for everybody to know. You get what I'm saying? And that's what a lot of these women don't understand. That should be, Quiet, be, be you know what I'm saying. It should be kept quiet. It should be it should be a secret. Nobody should be knowing that. That's embarrassing. And the fact that she allegedly cheated with Future, it's a L all the way, uh, Marcus Jordan. More like dumbass Jordan. Like what are you doing, bro? Like you you a little nerd, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You a little simp ass nerd, bro. I was honestly trying to help you, Marcus, but honestly, I'm not trying to help you no more. Fuck you, bro. Like you just pissed me off. Cuffing the old ass Larsa Pepper. What, what were you thinking, bro? I'm telling y'all, bro. When y'all boys gonna start listening to Future, man? Don't cuff these hoes. And I'm not saying don't get in a relationship, but not with women like that. You gotta know who to pick. Y'all don't know how to pick talent. Y'all, 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 y'all radar is fucked up. You gotta get a new radar. Cause right now your radar is telling you some shit that's not correct. Y'all, it's it's almost like dudes do the opposite of what their biology is. It's like. Oh, she's been ran through. She's allegedly a cheater. She's known to go from one ball to the next. Her, she got a bunch of plastic surgery done. Um, she's fucking old as shit. Probably can't have kids. Yeah, I think I'm going to cuff her. What? You niggas is thinking backwards. Yeah, man. You boys is thinking backwards. But that's all I got to say, man. Um, I honestly have, I have no other words, bro. It's just sad, honestly. Actually, you know, it, it, hey, if you want to do that, Marcus Jordan, if that makes you happy, being with being with that type of woman, you go for it, bro. You can take him. <laughs> you you can take him. But me and my guys who watch this channel, y'all know what's up, man. And y'all know that's not the type of woman you should be coveting or trying to court or being in a serious relationship with or even have kids with. You know what I mean? Is this the type of woman you want to spend the rest of your life with who has a history and a past like that? Hey man, I don't know. Maybe maybe it is for for some of y'all, but for me and for all my guys, I don't think so, bro. I don't think so. And honestly, I'm not mad at Michael Jordan for disowning that shit, or not dis. He didn't disown him, but he he was like, I I disapprove of the marriage. I, I, I hey, if I was a father, 
I would say the same thing. I disapprove. I I I disapprove of that shit. I disapprove of it. You gonna get married to to Larsa Pippen? Get the fuck out my house, little nigga. But that's all I gotta say, man. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out, man. Peace.